Hi everyone, it's Jodie here again. I just thought I'd do a little bit of uh, narration over what I have done thus far with this girl. Um, at the present time I am mixing, I um, can't remember the name of the paints, green and a yellow as well as a very thick matte medium. That was to do the background just around those edges. Now I am doing the tones in green um, around the girl's face and I am measuring up to make sure that I've got things in the correct position yeah, as I'm painting. And um, just because if the face is too off balance then it you know it doesn't look quite right. And one thing that I've noticed is that I always end up doing the same style of lips. So I think I went back in later on and tried to correct it. But they still look pretty similar to all the other ones that I've done in the past. I've gone over the face with a flesh tone. And I'm having a go at trying to use, um, what do you call it? Um, I'm in a completely different room so I can't even see the products that I've used, very naughty of me I know, as you guys would probably like to know exactly what I've used. Um, glazing medium, that's what I'm using. I'm trying to paint using glazing medium and using layers and layers and tones of different colours to add the shading and the depth. Um, just, you know, trying to improve my own style. Um, get things looking a bit more lifelike or less amateur, I don't know what you want to call it, but anyway I'm just trying some different things. Uh, at this point I'm doing around the eyes and it's always good to sort of continue your colours and quite often just mix the colour I was using with the next colour that I want to use. Uh, it seems to work quite well. Um, well, that's my opinion anyway. <laughs> Just as I said, I'm going back over with a bit more green for shading because the whole project is, has a green tinge to it. That is the you know dominant theme. Later on I will add a praying mantis and that's green, her eyes are green, the background's got green, so her face should reflect the green I suppose. Um, yeah, uh, what else am I doing? I use a lot of pouring more gold of that um, glazing medium and the hands. The hands now are a bit of a sticking point for me. I practice and practice and practice drawing hands and when it comes to painting them uh, just I have quite a lot of trouble so I actually didn't video me painting the hands properly I went back in because I just felt a bit intimidated by having the camera going while I was trying to paint because I struggled but I am really pleased with how that turned out. So um, I just really just calmed myself down and thought about it. And I think they've come out looking pretty good. Um, you guys can be a judge of that as well. Uh, at the moment I'm putting some highlights in on her face and still using the um, glazing medium. And then I'm going back in with some brown tones. And just putting it back in the shadows, in the chin, on the forehead, and the eyes. And um, most of my paints are the golden as well as, um, well, I can't remember the name of the ones I use. <laughs> I think I show them at some other point. I have them sitting, because I'm a bit of a messy person and I don't have a lot of space. Um, so you sort of get, things get in the way and I end up painting chords and painting myself and 
I would like a bigger room, but I think I'm pretty lucky just to have a room full stop. But, uh, you know, you can't push these things, so... And I still, um, I work part-time, so it's not as if this is something that I do full-time. Uh, I'm going in now and putting, and have highlight, you know, putting more definition into her lips. And, um, yeah, I think basically she came out pretty good. I, I actually did struggle with this girl. I don't know why, because this is the third one that I've done. I suppose it's you just get a little bit out of practice when you're not doing the same thing all the time, but I just don't want to do the same thing all the time because I get bored and I don't want you guys to get bored either. So um, anyway, I'll, I might stop talking because I'm just, you know, jibber-jabbering as they say, and um, I'll see if I can attempt to put some music on. Okay, thanks for watching and I hope I've inspired somebody to... Have a go at this and, um, you know, if you like it, please give me a thumbs up. And if you subscribe, that would be absolutely fantastic because, you know, it's a bit of a buzz when people do. And thanks again. See you later, guys. Bye.